So Crestron, we like to integrate many different products together, and the easiest way to do that is to produce and build them all in-house. Uh, we've also developed a proprietary Infinet EX wireless mesh network system, so that's very stable even in the harshest Wi-Fi environments. Uh, the, the greatest thing about what we're, we're partnering with Yale to do is we put that Infinet EX gateway, that technology, right into their locks. This way they natively communicate right back to our control system. With Crestron you can control many different systems, HVAC, lighting, AV, all your media, shading solutions, pretty much anything you can plug into the wall we can control. We're currently able to interface with pretty much any security system that's out there. The only missing component was the actual front and back door locks themselves. So having this natively communicate means we don't have to add anything else to the system. Once it's there, we're talking directly back to the control processor through that mesh network that all the other devices are talking to. We are able to then add a lot of intellectual capabilities to the door locks that you might not think would be even available, like tracking who's coming in and out of the home as well as when they do that. So we can assign a separate passcode to each user to identify when they're coming in and out of the home. We can even identify a special passcode for say maybe a cleaning service who comes in on Tuesday from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. and that's it. So now they've got a special code, no one needs to be home to let them in, and you automatically know that they cannot come in unless you want them to. So we decided to partner with Yale Lock, because part of Crestron's go-to-market strategy is really in quality, as well as being the best in class. And Yale has also got those same attributes. So this is a high quality piece, especially when we're talking about security. And you want to have a durable piece, we're not replacing it a lot. Uh, the other thing that we looked at was our touchscreens have moved over to a capacitive touch, which is really what everybody's used to, and Yale has as well. So that's a nice matching compatibility between the two companies, as well as the aesthetics. I mean, it's a touchscreen with this beautiful blue glowing numbers. It's, it's beautiful to look at.